Hey everybody, uh, have you ever had the seared ahi tuna at Outback or your favorite restaurant? Well, I'm going to make that recipe for you here today. You're going to love it. All right, so what I have here is a couple of about four to five ounce uh, tuna fillets. So what we're going to take is I have a spice mixture here, some soy sauce, and some olive oil. So I just take a little bit of olive oil and just pour on this. I'm just going to spread it around with my hands like this. Make sure all my sides are coated really good. And then also the same with some soy sauce. Just put a little bit on it. Just get that little bit of that saltiness and just mix it onto both sides. You add some more of the soy later, so don't doesn't have to be perfect. Not a whole lot of it. All right, you just really want to put this on so that the seasonings will stick. All right, so what I have here is a mixture that I created. It has uh, in it um, sesame seeds, black sesame seeds, some um, white pepper, some black pepper, salt, garlic, and ginger in this. Um, it's a really good seasoning mix. You want to make sure that it's coated really well. So put it in there and then take it, press it down with your fingers. Make sure it's on there really good. And we're going to do both sides with it here. So what we have here is I have my pan set on a medium high heat and it's already nice and warm so I'm going to take a little bit of olive oil and put it in the pan. Give that a little stir here and I've got my two tuna fillets and I'm going to put them in this and we're just going to sear the outside edges. That's it. I'm going to maybe cook it about, uh, I don't know, 30-45 seconds um, max a minute on each side and get all the sides nice and seared and then we're going to pop it in the fridge uh, and you want to leave it in the fridge for a couple hours to cool completely down. There you go. Turn your pan off. And then you want to take this here and put it in the refrigerator and let it cool down for, I don't know, two, three hours so it's completely cool all the way to the center. All right, so our tuna has been in the fridge for a while now. So what we're gonna do is just take it out. And I'm going to just slice it thinly. it with just a little bit of soy sauce. So I'm just going to take just a tiny bit of soy sauce and finish it just like that. Let's wipe the plate up, try and clean it up the best you can. I'm not a professional, obviously, but this is good food. Hope you enjoy it. Ahi tuna from Outback.